<laughs> we don't deserve dogs. <laughs> R slash blessed images. You're gonna see my soft side with this episode, so get ready. Also, disclaimer, because YouTube guidelines. Oh, it's We Rate Dogs. I love this Twitter. I, they were my first account to follow. This is Bessie. She was told to blink once if she accepts her role as Flower Queen. Ultimate goddess of yard happiness. 14 out of 10. Hashtag Senior Pup Saturday. Oh, Look at those eyes. Oh, those eyes are just... <laughs> It, this the subreddit is low key torture because I can't pet the animals. <laughs> he looks so happy just to be participating with his little apron on. <laughs> do 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 you think he's making making woofles? <laughs> I hate myself. Killer whale. Halo Five Guardians. Sorry after I assassinated you if it looked like I was teabagging. I was trying to not get hit in the head. <laughs> Saudi Arabia accidentally prints textbook showing Yoda sitting next to the king. <laughs> How do you make that mistake? That's... <laughs> mm, the king of Saudi Arabia I am close friends with. Uh, that's an unsolicited deck pick. I heard chicks really like them. That is a really nice deck. It's, uh, it's quality wood. It's not the biggest, but it serves its purpose. <laughs> How to be a good boy. <laughs> this is a class that's worth the thousand dollar admission fee. <laughs> Please help us. My pet lizard went missing September 7th around 5 p.m. He jumped out of my pocket by the student center because he f***ing loves sushi. He responds to the name Francis, but will also respond to Chubby. <laughs> Chubby is a 10 pound. Oh my, what? <laughs> Two and a half foot Amazonian bearded dragon. If found, do not pick him up. He will sh if you find Jerry, please call my brother Nolan. If Nolan doesn't answer, call me at insert phone number. We love Johnny Cox. Bring him home, please. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bob Ross, ultimate devil beater. I, I love everything about this. <laughs> It's eight hundred and sixty-four dollars. That's worth every penny. Oh wait, and also it's ninety-nine cents. My bad for missing that important detail. Oh. <laughs> Dread it. Run from it. Ed Pats will arrive all the same. This guy got on the bus and just stared at me and Lola Belly on my lap for a solid thirty seconds, then goes. Are you allowed to have dogs on the bus? And I just shrugged. Then he pulls out a chihuahua out of nowhere. They had us in the first half, I'm not gonna lie. Rare Kitten was born with two faces, grows up into the most beautiful cat ever. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Oh. <laughs> PetSmart is selling Halloween costumes for guinea pigs. That is, that is absolutely amazing. I, I want to see what they have in their inventory. Oh my god, this is, this is absolutely amazing. I, <laughs> there's only nine costumes, but they're all amazing. Look at this little baby bat sitting patiently while being weighed. <laughs> I like how he has his little hands over the side of the cup. <laughs> He's just staring up at them. <laughs> He looks so fuzzy. <laughs> You're a bean. <laughs> Thank you. Heinz <laughs> Bessler, house <laughs> security. <laughs> My daughter, who has ASD, received straight D's on her report today. She cried and said, I've let everyone down. This is my report card for her. Dad's report card. Name, Sophie. Funny. 
A. Loves dogs. A. Fighting with the boys. A. Drawing and making robots. A. Imagination. A plus. Best daughter ever. A plus. Not the hero we deserve, but the hero we needed. <laughs> <laughs> Just imagine being in a restaurant, looking <laughs> over. I just, I just noticed the the grandpa's is also in on the cast. <laughs> They're looking for Kevin. Have you seen Kevin? Oh, this is just precious. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh. I, my brain can't comprehend the level of adorableness in this image. It just can't. Oh, this is... Oh, this this restores, like, a little bit of faith that I have in just, just humanity in general. Oh. Oh, it's just so great. I really hope there's not something super f***ed up behind this whole thing. You've probably seen this Venn diagram already, but allow me to show you once again the greatest Venn diagram ever. It's pretty great, isn't it? Oh, I'm not gonna lie, when I saw the nail clipper, I got a little scared because of the previous images I've been seeing, but this, this makes me happy. This, this is a wholesome nail clipper, not, not, not like some of the other ones I've been forced to look at. Mayor Stubbs the cat. <laughs> Why do we never talk about the fact that for the past 15 years in a small town in Alaska, the mayor has been a cat? Mayor Stubbs. He doesn't raise our taxes. We have no sales tax. He doesn't interfere with business, said Lori Steck. He's honest. And he only drinks water from a wine glass. A town decided that a cat would be a better mayor than people. He's, he's good. Probably the best we've had. I want an animal as a mayor. Poor kid. I'm very sorry I was riding my bike and lost balance scratching your car. Please take this as an apology. I know it's not much. Oh, dude. R slash Taco Bell. Food really good here. I like the red stuff you put on your taco. I had the taco box, the taco really good here. And I like the red spicy stuff on the Dorito taco. I like you. I like how you write sentence. I love you, actually. Oh, that is, this is unbelievably wholesome. Doctor has made a 3D print of an ultrasound from an expecting mother who is blind. Oh, this is just so pure. Oh, I love this. Breaking 911. Hurricane Dorian. Bahamas woman brings 97 dogs inside single home to protect them from storm. Odos. Look at all of them. Look at all of them just screwing around and being good boys and girls. Fatigue zone in long and boring roads in Australia to keep drivers alert. Fatigue zone, keep playing trivia, it may save your life. Fatigue zone, question, floral emblem of Queensland. Answer, the Cooktown Orchid. There should be a subreddit for blessed design when stuff like this happens. <laughs> it's this super premium dog. <laughs> the derp out phase just makes it so much better. I asked Nintendo support to draw me their favorite animal. They, they delivered. Chicken. Please include a drawing of your favorite animal in the return package. <laughs> someone, someone tore off the original chicken drawing and <laughs> monkey. We got a platypus, a butterfly, and a squid. <laughs> and a squid with a... I keep saying squid. And an octopus, got it right, with a top hat. This is, that's amazing. <laughs> Do you guys know that snakes can be cute? Well, uh, here's one with a top hat. Look at him. He is very happy to have his top hat. I honestly love how someone took time out of their day to like fasten string that would perfectly go around their little snake's head and put it on them. I can't tell if the snake is happy or angry, but either way, he is adorable. Another We Rate Dogs tweet. I just love this Twitter. This is Jessie. She works at a children's hospital teaching patients not to be afraid of certain procedures. For an echocardiogram, just lie on your back and hold your mom's hand. 14 out of 10. What a good dog. 
<laughs> Disabled huskies bring comfort during Hurricane Dorian. Oh, that's so precious. Oh, I love it. <laughs> they even put a little tie on him. <laughs> a worthy protester. <laughs> Whatever you're protesting, count me in. Hey, Oz. Oh boy, what is it, little Oz? Look, look. Look at this frog wearing a raspberry. I want one. You know, whenever you appear, like, the comment section gets kind of, uh, you know, not good. What do you mean? I'm just a text-to-speech voice. Just don't worry about it. <laughs> I love this style of costumes for dogs. They have little arms. We we have one that's a Yoda costume for my little Shih Tzu. <laughs> They're just so great. I wonder if I can find a picture of it. Matilda, 1996. Director Danny De... Oh, no way! Danny DeVito directed Matilda? I did not know this! Hold up, Danny DeVito directed the most influential film of my childhood? I know, right? Not only directed it, but starred in it. Took care of Mara Wilson, Matilda, while her mother was in hospital with cancer and even managed to get an advanced copy of the movie for her to watch before she succumbed to her illness. The man is a treasure. I didn't know this was a thing. I uh, deleted my weather app because there's a guy in my office that always tells me anyway and the app never asks me how my weekend was. Shout out Bill! My weekend was awesome man, thanks for asking. R slash ask reddit. What rule was made because of you? Men are allowed to wear business casual shorts in the office. Dress code didn't allow for men to wear shorts, but did allow skirts. Showed up in a kit until the rules were changed. Last week I planted this tree and today when I checked, I see this. Nature is truly incredible. Oh. Dogwood is really blooming this year. Oh, it's another We Rate Dogs. This is Maggie. She was shot seven, oh, 17 times and had her ear oh, cut off before being rescued. Her new life consists of cuddling with her sister Mishka and showing others how to see with their heart. Last month she passed her therapy dog test, solidifying her spot among the best ever. 15 out of 10. And then below, Satan. That poor baby. <laughs> Do not feed the wolf! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I have so many questions. Why not? The poor thing looks hungry. Men of Reddit, in what ways do you show a girl that you're interested in her? Edit, I'm a girl. Man, when you get older, you don't have time for the game, so you might as well stop playing them now. Just. Talk to her and tell her directly how you feel. If she doesn't feel the same way, that's okay. Just move on and eventually there will be another one that feels the same as you do. Whatever you do, don't let yourself get hung up on someone that just doesn't share your interest in a relationship. Yes! It's the crossover episode we've all been waiting for! Satan. Yes, I have a three-headed dog and yes, you can pet him when you're in hell. We rate dogs. Nice. Well... Will you rate him for me? <laughs> Gonna tell y'all what I can hear now that I got my hearing aids. Birds! They chirp and it's so beautiful! Faraway cow moos. My friend has this in his backyard and to say I cried is an understatement. My best friend's singing voice. Chickens! Chicken noise. Me, sobbing. The filter for my fish tank. Bubble, bubble, bubble. <laughs> I sit in the bass section in band. Today I could clearly hear the flutes up at the front. They're not great, but I can finally hear them. This is the purest thing ever, oh my god. This is so nice, I'm gonna cry, I can't even imagine. This just made me realize how much I actually take my hearing for granted. Thank you everyone for watching this video. Oz was an idiot and forgot to record an outro, and is currently editing this away from the mic. So here I am. Please subscribe and ring the notification bell, or else I will cease to exist. Also, Oz will be streaming on his gaming channel this weekend, so go subscribe there as well.